the Butler Creemore News. Uh, they were instrumental in, in this happening. Uh, we had a hard time with Harry. He had to put a paper out, but he wanted to be on the line. <laughs> I felt so sorry for him. I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know what to do. Uh, he, he'd, he'd stay up all night getting the paper out and be there in the day. And Bibi, his wife, uh, the same way. Uh, if they could have and got somebody else to run the paper, they would have done it and, and been on the line the whole time. Harry was right there 100% the whole way. And uh, his paper won a, an award for a, a paper for the size town in which he publishes for a weekly and so forth and so on. And he could invite one couple to go with him to the award ceremony, which was a necktie thing. Now, for people that don't know Harry, Harry and neckties don't go together well. Harry don't like neckties, he's like me. And, but he was dressed to a tee that night. He said he had his funeral suit on. And he went over, and Barbara and I went with him, and uh, he and Bibi in to the award ceremony in a building. I don't know which one it is at the University of Chapel Hill. And the governor, Governor Martin, was making the presentations that night. And they, one would come by, and another one would come by, and another one would come by. And Harry gave me his little camera. And if you know Harry, sometimes he's a little bit absent-minded. He forgot to put me a fresh battery in it. It would take it about three minutes to, for the light to flash back on again. So I only got about three shots of it. But when Harry come ambling, I had his cowboy boots on, I believe. Uh, he come ambling out to uh, get, the, get the award. And Governor Martin was there. And it was for covering the story of the hazardous waste incinerator and so forth and so on. And Harry was grinning from ear to ear. He couldn't have been more pleased, and uh, to his credit, Governor Martin smiled too. He, politicians learn how to smile. When they're having surgery, they can smile, but they learn how to smile. And they had a little chit-chat up there, and uh, so forth and so on. And that was one of Harry's proudest moments, uh, winning that for fight in the and it was Governor Martin's uh, pet baby. And as a matter of fact, as the story goes, uh, uh, he did an interview off the things that he was most proud of, the three things, I forget what they were, and the uh, things that he didn't get accomplished, that he would, three things that he would most like to have done, and the hazardous waste incinerator was number one on the list of the things a governor of a state wanted to do and was stopped from doing. Now, if that doesn't make you to be proud to be a member of the group of people that did it, I don't know what does.